Hi folks and welcome to Cloud Label Service. Cloud Label Service, or CLS, is a label management tool that allows users to upload, verify, share, and print their labels with ease, all while utilizing the cloud. The current approach has many pitfalls that not only create inefficiencies, but could cost companies millions of dollars in recalls and errors throughout the supply chain. Companies are currently left to build their own infrastructure, which leads to inconsistent label templates as well as limited collaboration and visibility. To solve this, companies purchase services from third parties only to find out that they're almost as costly as the very issues that they are made to avoid. CLS provides a cost-efficient, centralized alternative that allows users to publish their labels and seamlessly integrate with their host systems. CLS has a variety of roles, including label owner, system administrator, and super admin. We will be looking at the system administrator's view. However, each role within the application has different views and functionalities. The first functionality is the label templates. You can either upload a new template that you've created in your design tool, or edit an existing one. The first tab allows you to view and edit the template's attributes, including the name and label size. The Sample Data tab is typically used by label owners in order to confirm that the data within the template, as well as the template itself, look appropriate. Sample data is stored on the preview until changed or deleted. Manual entry serves a similar purpose, however it is typically used for singular instances. Label consumers, external users, or suppliers can enter an instance of data in order to share the label via email, PDF, or print. The final tab is for importing data. This is done by downloading a sample CSV file, which you can use to fill in the variable data fields for multiple labels at a time. Once the CSV is uploaded, you can preview each label. Throughout the app, there are Share, PDF, Print, Download, and Upload capabilities. A more detailed look at label templates and CSV uploads can be seen in the how-to videos. Second functionality is our web services page. This is where we can create and manage the web service capabilities of the application. Once a web service is chosen, the page shows the endpoint to be set up in your source or destination system. It also allows us to upload the appropriate XSD for the web service definition. From there, we choose our label template and map out the appropriate fields. The web service page also allows for labels to be automatically printed or emailed. A more detailed look at web service creation and mapping can be found in the how-to videos. Next is the printer management view where we can create and manage the printers to be used within the application. Finally, we have our user management page. Here we can create and manage users. We only see users that belong to our own company and we can manage their roles from here as well. User lists can also be uploaded using a CSV template. Thank you for watching. Be sure to check out the how-to videos, and if you have any further questions about Cloud Label Service, please email sales at cloudlabelservice.com.